Hello, this is RGK, and today I'm going to show you Loop by John Cullen. Let's start with the options quickly. So, different sliders for music, rain, and uh, special effects like this droplet sound. So, you rain and droplet sound, the game that wants to have a very relaxing atmosphere. Cullen blind mode. For the video options, it's just like windowed mode on or off, which you have in the launcher menu, like most Unity games. Okay, let's start. Like this is the basics of the game. You have like different tiles and you have to arrange them so they make a closed loop. And here we go. This is the beginning of the game, so it's rather easy. Like you have only two colors and it's quite obvious what goes in the middle and what goes on the side and so on. So it can be done rather quickly, but there is no timer, there is no counter of, on, of how many moves you require, so nothing to stress you out. Except that rain sound, it's like a low definition rain sound and it's really really getting on my nerves. I cannot stand it. Even that droplet sound when you move your mouse, it's so annoying to me, I didn't find this relaxing at all. I'd rather remove it, remove it and put my own music instead, like Pink Floyd or something. Really relaxing. I like the sound of rain usually, but that one, no. So, uh, you get the idea of it. This one here. Yeah. Let's go a bit farther in the game. Here, look a line. And you can see that it gets a bit more complicated. So, where do I start? This one looks like a corner, or is it more this one? Okay, I'll go this one here, and then this one. I think they are arranged in triangles. So, you know, this one, I want a triangle that goes down and not up like this. And then this one in the corner here. Okay, then the, no, something is wrong here, I need these to connect. No, not like that. Yes, this one will be good. Okay, so then it means I would need a blue one that closes here. And then another blue one here. Down like that, then purple. Okay, then these two are similar. Thankfully, you can use any of the two. What else do we have here? I need a bottom purple. Okay, got it. Close the loop of orange one. Blue, okay, I'm almost there. This here. Okay, now this one here is very warm. Um, we got it. So it seems quite relaxing, but the problem is that sometimes you don't really know where to start. So this one or this one, two possibilities, so I could arrange my whole thinking around a wrong start and I would get stuck and frustrated and I would have to start again and sometimes you, you have to start multiple times until you finally get a few starting pieces that tell you where to go with the rest but if you don't get these starting pieces you're stuck and while in like more classical tabletop puzzle games you can find the real corners and then you can build around with the shapes or the drawings while well, here it's much more difficult and can be quite frustrating sometimes so actually for a relaxing tranquil puzzle game I, I had some moments where I was really frustrated with it you also have a level generator which is quite cool so let's see seed 42 and there is this new contraption here that you can turn, you cannot move it and you can turn but so far it doesn't help because there are too many possibilities uh, well you can see here where do I start so this one maybe like this but then it doesn't work, it doesn't connect here so let's see this and this and then that's my starting point Mm, this one here okay so I'm not gonna solve everything right now so I just want to talk about the steam cells that ended 
I didn't have time to record as many videos as I wanted, but I'll still try to do a few more and if you like the games you can just buy them directly or you can put them in your wishlist. I wish there were categories in the Steam wishlist, because I'm starting to have too many games in there. Okay, does that make sense? No, actually it's not making much sense on all the side. I should use this part here. Okay. Yeah, now uh, planning to test uh, an interesting Castlevania, like Metroidvania type of game that uh, is a bit like Dark Souls, but in platformer. But that's not for yet. I first need to play it, and I also want to play the games I bought during the Steam sales and make a few more videos. So we'll see. Okay, so about this game loop. Do I like it? Do I not like it? Uh, it's okay. I prefer puzzle platformers than just straight up puzzle games. And this one is kind of attractive, but not very easy. Yeah, I definitely don't want the sound of the rain anymore. Yeah, I'll put my own music. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye bye.